They've never been behind uh, the expo line, on the line. They don't understand how it works. Of course, they're they're often wrong. But it it just doesn't matter whether they're wrong or right. And I feel like a lot of people feel like it's their duty to prove them. No, dude, you're wrong. But that that's not our job. We're not judges, and we're not jurors, and we're not lawyers, right? We're we're servers. We're in the hospitality. Mm. But boy, are they wrong often? <laughs> Most of the time, I would say. What's the uh, the? Uh, please, can you tell me one instance when the customer is always wrong? Because I know, like bread is like a thing, right? Because uh-huh. people that aren't aren't uh, exposed to really good bread, yeah, only are exposed to one kind of bread, which is you know grocery store bread. Sure. I mean, people just don't know. I mean, when are you taught anything really about bread in America? Not not often. I mean, now no. I guess we're getting it because in the pandemic, people are getting into home baking and they're actually getting some pretty hardcore sourdough bread, which is cool. But, you know, a lot of people come in here confusing like, oh, I want whole wheat. And I'm like, no, you don't. You want multigrain. And I and I, I tell them like I show them like this is multigrain and this is whole wheat. And they're like, oh, yeah, I'll have the multigrain. Mm-hmm. They, they just they don't know. And, and I, don't, I don't need them to know, right? It's my job to educate them and it's my job to guide them on the good experience. So uh, I think knowing that they don't know actually helps, helps us in, in knowing that it's, it's our duty and our responsibility to guide them and to, to not focus on whether they're right or wrong, mm. right? It, yeah, I think they're often wrong, but it, it, it doesn't matter.